good day flute stars we're on to the fun bit of the um, <coughs> learning the flute where we get to put the whole flute together now you've probably made some progress with that part so what I want you to do now is take out the body of the flute um, and then um, carefully uh, insert that head joint into the body now you'll probably notice that I'm putting my hand around that so um, that end of the flute only because um, there's no key work there so I'm not going to risk damaging uh, any of the keys of the flute. So that's a cap that's on the end of the flute and that bit, pop it back in your case. Um, we'll line it up once we've got the foot joint on, so that's that bit there. And the foot joint you slip on and then you've got to make sure that that rod um, of, if you can see it there, that rod of the foot joint is aligned uh, approximately halfway up all those straight keys. So if you've got that happening, you're on the right track. You get your head joint on the flute and we've got to look down it and make sure that the, the blowhole actually lines up with all those straight keys. Not the two offset keys, which are these ones in the middle, but if you look down your flute, you'll have a whole lot of keys which are in line and that's got to be in line with your flute, uh, with, the, with the hole. Um, now, we talked about balancing the flute and that's really important it's not like you have to grip it it's more pushing with your right hand and keeping in with your left hand and against your mouth you'll actually find that you can support the flute without having to hold it at all so it's really a balancing technique there now your position of your fingers don't um, get the first little key all right with your index finger you're to play the second key miss the next one after that and get the fourth one along and then the fifth one. So that's your right hand if you remember. Your thumb should rest on that large thumb um, key. With your right hand you're going to put your pinky on the first um, series, first of the series of um, uh, buttons on the, on the foot joint and then your index finger, your middle finger and your fourth finger will go on those three last buttons. So once you've got all that done, then you're alright to play. You've got to remember of course that the flute's got to follow your mouth. So basically if I tilt the, the line of my head, then the flute's going to go with me. It's always got to be um, in line with your lips. Um, preferably keep, keep your back straight, um, your chin up, so don't stoop to play the flute and you're now ready to play. If you've got all that, you've got that all lined up so your blowhole's actually um, pointing to the, the ceiling. And three of the notes that we've looked at so far, well we've looked at um, E flat, so basically if you put everything on except for your um, left index finger, then you should get this sound. You'll notice I'm using my tongue to create the start of the note, so that's what I want you to do. And I'm creating separate notes just with um, that technique. Alright, we're going to look at F now. So it's the first three on, your left thumb down, and your right index finger. Plus your right pinky, which stays on for every note except for... Um, the D. So we're going to get to that, but we're going to look at F now. So it should sound like that. Again, if you're um, shooting out too much air too quickly, you're going to get a breathy sound, or you're going to get a really high note, or you're not going to get any note at all. So you've got to be really um, quite precise with that formation of the hole between your lips and getting the right sound. Um, we're going to look at um, B now, which we had a look in class. So that's going to be your first finger down and your left thumb and your right pinky. That's a B. If I put the next finger down, I get my A. Next finger down will give me a G. So there we are. We've got an um, E flat. We've got an F. We've got a B. 
A and a G. And I'm going to leave you with one more note. If you play your B with your left thumb on the top thumb key, so that one instead of that one, that one there, we get a B flat. So thanks guys, uh, enjoy the rest of the videos, there'll be four more coming, and practice hard.